I'm Tiff. I'm Tashari. And together we are TNT. And on this episode, we are continuing our series on foot discomfort. So the brand that we're featuring right now is Birkenstock. Birkenstock. So what you see here is basically what you get inside of the shoes that you know. Mm -hmm. If you don't know about these shoes, you should probably come and find out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now again, not every shoe brand works for every person. We mm -hmm. understand that. I know people don't like these shoes, but I love them. I'm a big fan. I think they're so comfortable. And um, the main reason why I find these to be so comfortable is the arch support and that mm -hmm. heel cup. Now. For those of you that don't know, and maybe you're experiencing some like crazy discomfort in the bottom of your foot, your heel up into your um, ankle and Achilles tendon, you're mm -hmm. probably experiencing plantar fasciitis. I'm not a doctor. I'm not diagnosing it. I would recommend you go and see a physician. Yes. Um, but a lot of times that's why people come and see us are for those reasons. Mm -hmm. um, and these really help. And the reason why these help is because there's this awesome heel cup that scoops up into the arch support, mm -hmm. which the arch support then holds up that tendon, which is the plantar fascia. Um, and that just, it's basically, um, like Tashari said in one of our other videos, it's basically a headache in the foot. It really is. It keeps it from getting inflamed. Again, that's like the headache part of it. Um, and that's what people tend to feel. And it's hard, sometimes it's hard to diagnose. You just, after rest, you go to put your feet down on the ground and it feels like you're stepping on needles. Or like it's just really, hot under the foot it's just a massive bunch of discomfort right not everybody experiences that mm -hmm. um but for those that do we recommend that you try these shoes try an arch support of some sort if these don't work for and you. stop going barefoot in the house yes yeah don't do that barefoot's do that. not good no no um so what birkenstock has done is they've created a couple different options here um and they're again they're all modeled after what they've been known for for a very long time which is the arch support that's in their shoes mm -hmm. um so these are basically the exact same thing just made with different types of materials so like you have the three-quarter length which again i always suggest a three-quarter length for a shoe that you cannot essentially gut out so if you just want something in your shoe that's going to make sure that you get the maximum support and you would definitely get that with the birkenstock and in keeping with how it is on the uh, shoe so can you hold that for me mm -hmm. you're still going to get that heel cup support you're also going to get the medial and lateral arch support you also get the metatarsal support the only thing you don't get in a three a three quarter arch support is a toe bar and really the toe bar has zero orthopedic value it's just mm -hmm. in your sandals it gives your toes something to do while you're walking around so you get that um, maximum amount of support to keep from that hyperextension. You don't want your foot doing that. You want it to stay up, stay stable, and stay leveled in a way. Um, another thing about their arch supports, which I really like, especially with these, they're still done with cork. So you get that customized feel after a while. Yeah, so it'll start to mold to your foot, which is awesome. Um, and the three-quarter length are great for those really nice dress shoes that our gentlemen have, where there's like no toe room. Mm -hmm. Same thing with our ladies. Um, they're great. I actually, I think I personally, I think I sell these to more guys with their dress shoes mm -hmm. um, than probably any other any other person. For myself personally, that's just me. And over the years, I've sold them to a lot of guys in their work shoes. And I'm not just like the dress shoes, I'm talking like their, their work boots. Um, and now that they've done other arch supports like the uh, Contact Sport and the Burko Active, if they can gut their shoe out, they definitely will. Yeah, so um, the Contact Sport is really awesome. Um, it has this, this layer of foam that's like padded. It's a really mm -hmm. dense foam, it's really awesome, but it, it's got some cushion there. The metatarsal arch on here is amazing and everything's all reinforced with this, um, with this white plastic piece here. So pretty much that plastic piece is this here. Right, so just made of two different materials. Again, that's cork, um, and this one is going to be made out of a plastic material. Um, it it is flexible. It's not mm -hmm. like it's not like a piece of stone that you're putting in your shoe. Mm -hmm. um, so you're going to have that flex and that give, but still have all that support that you need, especially um, in the arch area, which is really awesome. And then this one is made out of um, different materials, and it's definitely um, lighter yeah, um, than this one is. So you're still going to get that nice arch support it's a little bit more rigid at the i mean i'm um, sorry <laughs> got it backwards it's a little bit more flexible at the toes a little bit more rigid along the arch so i've had a lot of people like you see the nice little people on the box with their hiking shoes 
It's mostly what I've had people get them for. And not just because they can't seem to separate what they see from what it should be for, <laughs> but it just fits well. It does. And then the, the layering on the top of that uh, breathes really well, which yes. is nice. So that way you're not getting all sweaty and funky and gross in your hiking mm -hmm. shoes, running shoes, walking shoes, whatever the case may be. Um, <clears throat> so what we recommend is when you come in to try on uh, or to try the arch supports is bring, bring your shoes with you that you want to wear these in. You are not going to wear these in your Birkenstocks. No. Your Birkenstocks already have that. You're not going to wear these in shoes that already have arch support. Um, you want to have a shoe that we can take stuff out of or has nothing mm -hmm. so that way we can give you the support that you need and shoes that you love the way that they look. They go with perfect outfits or whatever um, or work shoes. That's mm -hmm. a little more. <laughs> logical but um, <laughs> but yeah so uh, bring in your shoes with you so that way you can try them in there because this may not work for you you may need something else because there is no magic bullet like mm -hmm. we always say. you always have a lot of options that's the beauty of being in a comfort shoe store we're not just going to uh, direct you in one direction you may take five or six honestly I have one insert for every brand that we have because my shoes fit differently mm -hmm. so i'll need something a little like i'll need something like this in one kind of shoe like mm -hmm. um i wear uh something similar to this in like my chucks because i need room in my toes so i don't want something that's long um and then i use something that's a little bit fuller in some shoes that may be a little bit too big for me mm -hmm. um so yeah, so there's there's just different reasons for everything and we totally encourage you to come and try something if you are feeling any type of discomfort, especially in your feet, your ankles, your knees, your lower back. Probably this is what you need to help kind of help that out because it just rebalances you because mm -hmm. our feet are not meant to walk on hard surfaces. It all starts from the bottom up. Yep. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Bye.